Simple harmonic motion. We will start with horizontal mass spring system. You know that the mass spring system could be horizontal and could be vertical. We will start with the horizontal and explain all the ins and outs of the harmonic motion for a horizontal mass system. Then we will move to the vertical mass system and explain it in more details. You have a mass M, you have a spring that's resting in the natural position or the equilibrium. You have the X initial starting here as zero. The net force is zero. Everything is settled down and rest. Right is positive, left is negative. Now the mass is pulled to its maximum displacement. That maximum displacement can be called as amplitude. When the mass is released, it begins to oscillate with a displacement that never exceed the maximum distance. The greater the amplitude, the more energy the system has. In this case, we have x equal a. So somebody came in and pulled the mass to the right and you have the maximum distance is wherever you pull the mass into. When you leave the mass alone, it will swing back and forth it is fighting between the return force and the applied force and the gravity force to be able to bring back the mass to the equilibrium where it was before. At the maximum displacement, the restoring force is at the maximum value and the acceleration of the mass using Newton's second law, F equals ma. When the mass is released, the acceleration will start from rest and the velocity is zero in this. So it will go, it will accelerate from rest towards the equilibrium position. As the mass goes or approaches the position, the velocity is increasing, but the restoring force is decreasing because the spring is not stretched as much as it was first, and the force would vary directly with displacement. Now, as the mass goes back to the return or to the equilibrium position at x node or x initial, x equals zero, it achieves maximum velocity. It would be moving towards the left or the negative direction, but the restoring force acting on it is zero because it is displacement is zero at that moment. The mass will keep moving through the equilibrium position and begin to compress the spring backwards. As it compressing the spring, the restoring force acts on the mass towards the right to return it to its equilibrium position. And this would cause some back and forth oscillation or what we call it as a harmonic motion to be able to bring it back to, to equilibrium until eventually it will reach the starting equilibrium point. So you can simplify the harmonic motion as the body efforts to bring himself back to equilibrium using the natural forces that he has. We are trying to walk you through the steps from the moment we pulled the spring and he went backward and to the right, to the left, to the right, to the left. So now we have the mass being stretched or squeezing the spring in this case is experiencing a restoring force that is going to the right. The amplitude here is equal and the opposite to its amplitude when it started at maximum displacement, the velocity is zero. Restoring force reached the maximum value again. Storing force is positive, displacement is negative, and so on. So the spring, in short story, we grab the mass, we pull it away from equilibrium, we let it go, so the mass keeps swinging back and forth, fighting between the return force of the spring and the effect of the applied force to be able to bring back equilibrium and stop at the starting point. So it is a golden rule that the entire harmonic motion will follow and obey the Hooke's law. Any mass spring system would obey the Hooke's law. At any instant, the restoring force is proportional to the displacement of the mass. Any object that obeys the Hooke's law undergoes a simple harmonic motion abbreviated as SHM. So the simple harmonic motion is oscillatory motion where the restoring force is proportional to the displacement of the mass. An object that moves with a simple harmonic motion is called simple harmonic oscillator. So what is the simple harmonic motion? Oscillatory motion where the restoring force is proportional to the displacement of the mass. Simple harmonic oscillator is an object that moves with a simple harmonic motion.